Assalamu alaikum all and welcome back to online classes again. This is your English class and today we have this book which is Understand and Communicate book 1 and I am going to teach you a grammar chapter from this book. So I am going to open this book on page number 128 and on page number 128 I have a grammar chapter. Yes. Here on page number 128, I have a grammar chapter which is countable and uncountable nouns. But before moving towards the back exercises of this chapter, let me tell you about what is countable and uncountable noun. So basically, these uh, countable and uncountable nouns are two types of noun and we all are very well familiar with the term noun. So, noun is basically a name of a person, place, or a thing like Qaid Azam, Bahawalpur, Umulkra Public School, Karachi, Lahore, Aisha, Ali. So, these all things are so the name of a person, place, or a thing is known as a noun. And this chapter is related to countable and uncountable nouns. So, they, here we have two types of noun. First is countable, it means the name is indicating a, a noun that can be counted is known as a countable noun and the second type of noun we have is uncountable noun it means those nouns that cannot be counted are known as uncountable nouns for example if we see example of countable noun like box this is a countable noun we can count the boxes we can count the chairs in a class we can count the tables present in a class and in the case of uncountable noun, if I say like news, then news is such kind of thing that cannot be counted. Second, if I give example of politics, if I say physics, so these are such 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 examples that cannot be counted. So these are these all are uncountable nouns, whereas these all are countable nouns. Now after this, move towards moving towards the back exercises of this chapter. So, here we have this book and I am going to open the back exercise of this chapter. So, yes, here you have exercise number one of this chapter which is on page number 130 of English and Understand and Communicate book one. So, the first statement is give the plural forms of the following nouns. Now, here we are provided with the nouns and we have to give the plural forms of these noun so very first one is tax its plural form is taxes ox ox oxen army armies a r m i e s armies y will be replaced with i e s uh, for the uh, plural case life l i v e s lives louse lice l i c e lice problem problems lady ladies whenever we have y at the end of a noun or a word it will be replaced with ies so it would become ladies stable stables pouch pouches by adding es at its end house houses latch latches analysis analysis by the addition of es radius radii thief thieves T H I E V E S thieves, tooth is a single uh, is a single th uh, tooth, and teeth is its plural. Potato potatoes, toy toys, crisis it will remain crisis. C R E C R I E S E S, chief chiefs C H I E V E S chiefs, booth, its answer is booths by the addition of S. Then we have value, its answer is values. Key Case, locus, loci, scarf, scarves, S C A R V E S, fox, foxes. After this, we have the second uh, exercise. Complete the following sentences, inserting the plural forms of the nouns in brackets. Now, in all these statements, we are provided with uh, the nouns in the brackets, and we have to make the plural form of these nouns. First one is done over here. So, first statement is: We need several boxes of matches. Their houses are infested with mice. The sheep graze on the hills. These trees shed their leaves yearly. Oxen are made to pull the pluffs. Flies, F-L-I-E-S, flies can spread harmful diseases. Q, 
keep knives k n i v e s knives away from the reach of children please iron these handkerchiefs and shirts for me the woman w o m e n is its plural form gather strawberries y will replace with i e s and make them into jam also is a fertile in desserts so this is the second exercise after this we have third exercise related to this topic that is pick the correct word from the pair given in each sentence now we have to pick a correct pair of word from this from this uh, correct word from the pair which is given over here so the first statement is the ship's crew crews admired their captain tremendously its first ans its answer is the ship's crew single one crew they showered the winner with congratulations when she went back to her seat congratulations he returned me the book with thanks news of the military cop was announced on television mr akbar teaches economics at the university samuel left his belongings at the hotel the manager told his staff that he was dissatisfied with their work clear sky always mean good weather primitive people eat only the food which can be grown near their homes primitive people eat only the foods not food food is the single one we have to use foods over here this plural form please write to me at your earliest convenience this was first one after this we have this fourth exercise in which you have to fill in the blank with the plural forms of the noun in brackets so this is your practice exercise you have to do this exercise by yourself what you have to do you have just to put plural form of this word which is given in bracket over here according to the requirement of the statement so this exercise is assigned to you by me as your practice exercise so this is all about this chapter which is countable and uncountable noun and this chapter is on page number 128 of your english understand and communicate books hopefully you will enjoy this lecture thank you